Hi, this is King David for David Goliath Music, and this is how to make nitty style beats. Now, this is an intro. I'm going to let you hear what it's going to sound like. Then I'm going to show you exactly, step by step, how to create this beat and what techniques went into it. Hopefully, what you'll do is take these techniques and transfer them onto your personal music and create better music. How's that sound? Is that cool? All right, listen to this. Okay, so you can hear that you have a professional mix, you have uh, carefully chosen instruments, and then you have a really well put together playlist orchestration, which allows the listener not to get bored with your music. Now I'm going to show you how to do that in this tutorial. If you're watching this from YouTube, this is only a preview, and I know that this is not the full tutorial. However, there's too much information to put in a 10-minute video on YouTube. So come down to BeatClass.com or Fruity Loops University and get the complete tutorial there. Okay, so I'm going to teach you how to pick your instruments, how to pick the right tempo, um, how to pick the right claps, the right kicks, the wood block, how to tune your kicks. Uh, I'm going to teach you about using hi-hats, cymbals, crashes, where to put them, how to tune them, snare rolls, how to use them, synthesizers, and detuning your synth notes to give it more of a polished sound. I'm going to teach you about effects and effects routing. I'm going to teach you about laying out your song and putting things in the proper order so that you can keep your listener interested in your music. Then I'm going to teach you how to use effects again and how to mix it down. All right, this is King David, David Glass Music. This is the Nitty Style Beats, and I hope that you can take this and apply this to your own music. One love, King David.